maling lomo na mong lahat. I am Jella Biniga, a grade 12 student of Sirib National High School, taking up general academic strength. Our elective course is on agricultural crop production. And today, I will be demonstrating on how to graft cacao. But before that, what is grafting? Grafting is an act of joining two plants together. The upper part of the graft is called the scion, becomes the top of the plant. The lower portion is called the root sac, becomes the root system. So another question is, why do we graft? So, grafting helps to resist diseases like block pot. It helps to improve yield and quality. It improves architecture and vigor. So in science selection, you should look for a pencil size diameter that has a color greenish brown. So we are going to get our bud stick in preparation for our scion. It should have a pencil size diameter and a color of greenish brown. So it should look like this. In rootstock selection, it should be grown by seed, grafted at least four to six months, healthy and disease free. Rootstock stem diameter needs to be the same diameter with the scion or if possible, larger. In grafting or before grafting, you should prepare your materials and tools. First you need is your grafting knife, grafting tape, grafting cover, scion, and your rootstock. And always remember the 4S. Safety for yourself, safety for your colleagues, safety in the environment, and safety for your tools. And now, I will be demonstrating to you on how to graft a cacao. So, our materials and tools is now ready. So first, we have our rootstock, our plant. So, it is grown with seed. Our, si our bud stick. So, this bud stick, we are going to make this as our scion. Next is our grafting knife or our blade. So, for now, the available uh, I have is this uh, cutter blade so as an alternative this plastic will be used as a cover for our uh, after we graft our plant and importantly so we have our grafting tape all right so let's proceed to our grafting So when we are grafting, ensure that we have 8 to 6 leaves below. Then set it aside. Let's prepare our scion. So, cut the terminal bud. and followed by the lateral buds. All we need is four bud eyes. So let's count from the terminal bud. So one, two, three, four, and we are going to cut this or here. So the proper position for grafting is to put your other uh, knee down through the ground and the other one up here. Put, uh, put your elbow down, your knees, and start to move the other hands where you are holding your butt.
scion is ready. So when we are going to make our scion, make sure that the length of your wedge is one and a half inch. So this is our scion. Now let's proceed to our slitting. Put your two index finger beside the stem. Then push your blade slowly. Get your scion and insert it into, into the slit. After we secure our scion into our rootstock, we are going to cover it with this plastic towel base. So, we are going to put this to secure or ensure that water cannot enter our skin. So, it will not get rotten. So, here's our finished product. So, I don't think